Okay, guys, I, I, I just want to do this real quick. The lighting in here is not that great because I'm actually charging one of my lights. I wasn't going to do a video right now, but I just got these things that I ordered, um, and I just am too impatient, so I want to try it. What in the world? Okay, I'm sorry I'm getting sidetracked. I don't know who that number is. Hold on a second. Okay, delete. Okay, so... I don't know what they're called because it's not in English. None of it's in English, but they're these little they're these little things that are clear. I know they look white on here, but I got to peel the paper off. They're clear and you put them on your eyelid just above your crease to help open your eye up a little bit. So, if you look at my eyes, I'll try to look straight. See how one of my eyelids is more um I just completely lost my train of thought. What's it called? I have no clue. I just am completely drawing a blank and I say it all the time. Um, hooded eye. So I have hooded eyes so when I when I open my like when I'm like this you could see my full eyelid but when I look straight ahead you could see the crease folds over over my eye and this eye is more hooded than this eye. Um, so you can see that the crease goes all the way down to the end of my eye and over here it completely covers it. So trying to do um, you know winged liner for me is really hard so if you like to do winged liner or you would just want to make your eyelids you know your eyes look a little brighter you can use these things to help your eyelid crease in a different area so we're gonna we're gonna give it a shot I don't, I don't know if I'm doing this right or not because none of this is in English but I just peel I just peeled one off it comes with this little stick thingy and, Thanks, buddy. So I just peeled one off the paper and I put it on here. Um, and now I gotta peel the back paper off. How do you? Hold on. Don't do that, Misty. Okay, got peeled one side off. Let me peel the other side off. I don't know. I'm using the I'm using the this tool actually to, to peel it off. Okay. So I'm trying to keep it as clean as possible. Okay, so now I have I have it on here. You can see my fingerprints on it because I don't know what I'm doing. And I'm already wearing makeup, which you should probably put this on before your makeup because it says you could put makeup on over it. Um, it is sticky on both sides, so I'm going to try to do this on my phone. I don't know how well it's going to work. You can also cut it to fit your eye. This will probably be a lot easier with a mirror. Oh my god, stay. Okay, I'm doing it how it says. It's probably because of my makeup. I'm doing it how it says to do it. Or how I think it says to do it, because like I said, it's not in English. Let's try this again. Oh, get my hair out of the way. Jackson, leave the kitty alone, please. That's so crooked. Okay. Is it different? Did it make it is a little different. This will probably be a lot easier with my mirror, but it makes it to where your your eyelid creases in a different area, um, so that you could see more of your eyelid. Huh. Okay. First time use, not too bad. I'll probably try it again later with my mirror because <laughs> this looks funny. It is sticky on both sides, so it feels a little weird, but if you want your eyes brighter and more open, it's worth the shot, unless you want to get surgery to, you know, snip snip in there, which I'm not too keen on, but not too bad. Maybe I'll try it again later. We'll see.